Hey, what's up, guys? Today I'm gonna review the best Twitter app in my what I think is the best Twitter app, TweetDeck. Now, TweetDeck isn't just for Twitter; it's mainly for Twitter. But you can sign in with Facebook or Twitter, or you can make a, a TweetDeck account. So I've just reinstalled the app. Uh, I'm gonna go sign in. Okay, so I've just signed in with uh, TweetDeck, and uh, it was very easy to sign in. You just basically sign in with Facebook or Twitter. If you press the uh, plus button up here, you've got more, so you've got your Twitter trends. You've got your account, so you can click on it. You've got your timeline. You've got your mentions. Direct messages, favorites, and my tweets. So obvious. We close out of this. We got our normal timeline. Normal. You can slide across to check um, different things. You can pull up to refresh. Nothing. Um, so yeah, that's basically. No, it's not it, but it's. It is a very nice Twitter app. I I really do like it. So if I was to go into my Use, no, I'm not sure, I don't know how to do that. Um, but what you can do is edit how many pages you have. You just hold down. Well, no, you don't hold down, but you pinch out. And this is really cool. So you can delete. Hmm. You can delete a page out. And it eventually works. Now it's just frozen up, um, but as you can see here, you can switch. You can switch between them. You've got a settings bar, which basically you can change the timeline and what what previews on there, so you can add a Facebook in with there. Um, one thing which you can't do is status update through Facebook using this app. Um, you can't. Yeah, you, you, do, you can only read your timeline. It's not great with Facebook. Um, but, yeah. So, let's try it now. Deleted. Deleted. Yeah. Delete. Done. And we can go... Add something like my tweet. So, you can hit the add button. That'll add it in. Now I'm going to show you Facebook integration. So if we go plus, we can edit, we can add another Twitter account or add a Facebook account. We got it opens up Facebook automatically. And now you have to authorize it. You just hit OK. Now just simply open the app back up and your Facebook account will be in there. So now I can go into Facebook and I can add my news feed into here. So now I've got uh, I've got my timeline, well not timeline but my uh, Twitter feed. I got my tweets and I've got my Facebook feed, which um, yeah. So. And this is by far my favorite Twitter app. There are plenty more features. I'm going to set that to tweet. And yeah, simple tweet. Um, there are a lot more features with this, but you can't have to figure them out yourself. If this video helped you out, please hit the like button, subscribe for more videos, follow me on Twitter, uh, Facebook, my websites and all that will be in the description and I'll see